p of x is equal to x to the power of 4 plus 5x square minus 7x cube plus 8 is. So number of zeros means the utmost zeros will be the degree of the polynomial. So maximum zeros will be 4. Correct option is C. Which of the following is a terminating decimal? So 5 by 16 is the terminating decimal because 16 can be expressed as 2 to the power of 4 and same as 5 to the power of 0. If denominator is in the form of 2 power of n, 5 power of m, then it is a terminating decimal. So correct option for second question is B, 5 by 16. In triangle ABC, DE are the midpoints of AB and AC respectively. Then DE is, so if it is 8 centimeters, obviously D will be, DE will be 4 centimeters. Seventh so question, if cot theta is equal to 8 by 15, then sin theta is equal to. Sin theta is opposite by hypotenuse, opposite to theta is 15 and hypotenuse is 17. So 15 by 17 is the correct answer. Ninth question, P of x is a polynomial and maximum zero of P of x are 3. Then which of the following diagram shows the correct polynomial? This is the correct no polynomial because this curve is meeting x-axis at 3 points. Correct option for ninth question is A. Tan theta is equal to 5, 5, then secant theta minus tan theta is 1 by 5. If triangle ABC is similar to triangle EFD, angle A is 50 and angle F is 55, then angle C is 75. The value of sin 0, sin 1, sin 2, so on, sin 20 is 0. Reason is sin 0 value is 0, 0 into any number will also be the 0. So correct option for 13th question is D. If p of x is equal to x cube minus 6x square plus 7x minus 5, then the quotient of x square is, quotient of x square is minus 6. Correct option is C. If the sum of zeros of a polynomial is 3 and product is 2, then the quadratic polynomial is. We know the quadratic polynomial formula x square minus sum of zeros into x plus product of zeros. So x square minus sum is given as 3, product is given as 2 x square minus 3x plus 2 is the correct option which is C. Cot square theta minus cosecant square theta answer is minus 1. You know the identity 3 cos cosecant square theta minus cot square theta is 1 but here in the question cot square theta minus cosecant square theta will be obviously minus 1. If p is equal to a cube b square c and q is equal to a to the power of 4 b c square where a, b, c are prime numbers then hcf of p and q are it will be a cube b into c. Set of factors of 36 is x set. Then which of the following is not a member of x? So 36 is a factor of 36. 1 is a factor of any number that is 36. 18 is also a factor of 36 because 18 twos are 36. But 7 is not the factor of 36. Correct option for second question is a. Degree of the polynomial root 2 x cube minus 3x square plus 4x plus 1 is 3. Degree means highest power. Highest power in the given polynomial is 3. So degree of the polynomial is 3. In a quadratic polynomial ax square plus bx plus c, then minus coefficient of x by coefficient of x square represent sum of 0. Coefficient of x means b. Coefficient of x square is a. Minus b by a is Formula for sum of zeros. If the pair of equation 2x minus ky plus 3 is equal to 0 and 4x plus 6y minus 5 is equal to 0, they represent parallel line, then find the value of k. In the place of k, there will be one number we need to find. If the lines are parallel, we need to take the condition a1 by a2 is equal to b1 by b2. Here a1 is 2, a2 is 4, so 2 by 4 is equal to b1 by b2 minus k by 6. So when 2 ratios are equated we need to do cross multiplication minus 4 into k is minus 4k 2 6 are 12 so k value m out in the end 12 by minus 4 which is minus 3 so value of k is a option minus 3 which of the following represents statement two women and five men can do together a piece of work in four days in the form of a linear equation so we need to change this given situation in form of linear equation. The correct option will be 2 by x plus 5 by y is equal to 1 by 4. Which of the following statement is false? Two squares are similar. This is a true statement. Two equilateral triangles are also similar. This is also true. Two isosceles triangles are similar. This is false. Two line segments are similar. Correct option for 12th question is C. 
put in the question find the value of secant square 30 minus cos square 60 secant square 30 value before finding secant square 30 we have to take the secant 30 value which is 2 by root 3 whole square cot 60 value is 1 by root 3 whole square so 2 square value is 4 root 3 square value is 3 1 square is 1 root 3 square value is 3 so denominator is same 4 minus 1 is 3 3 by 3 answer is 1 correct option for 14th question is D 15th question if sin 35 is equal to cos a then the value of a is sin 35 can be expressed as sin 90 minus 55 so 90 minus 55 value 35 ka batti ee vidhanga raaskoal e nduk 90 minus a these call and complementary angle ka batti standard angles vina hai nchi 0, 30, 45, 60, 90 any of this apart from this any angle we call it as complementary angle so 35 can be expressed as 90 minus 55 sin will become cos cos 55 is equal to cos a cos will be cancelled a will be 55 degrees correct option is option b 55 5 7 10 9 10 8 10 12 13 mode of the given data is mode means most repeated value here 10 is repeated more times so mode value is 10 correct option is b in the given figure ad is equal to 4 db is equal to 4 a is equal to 6 ec is equal to 6 de is equal to 5 find the length of bc so which no values diagram rakaram raskundam ad 4 is equal to db 4 ae 6 ec 6 the length of bc is equal to first question which of the following is not a terminating decimal so terminating decimal can't be find out chayali. first denominator check chayali. Denominator is in the form of 4, power, 4 into 5 under 2 power of n, 5 power of n rupal no This is in the form of 2 power of m and 5 power of n. Then it is a terminating. C1 chudam. So 5 by 80, 40 can be written as 8 5 of 40. So 2 cube 5. Again it is a terminating decimal. 7 by 4. 2, 4 can be expressed as 2 square. Again it is a terminating decimal. So not terminating decimal option is 21 by 98. Ninth question, which of the following is not a trigonometric identity? Sin square theta plus cos square theta is 1 is a trigonometric identity. Cosecant square theta minus cos square theta is 1 is also a trigonometric identity. Secant square theta minus tan square theta is also a trigonometric identity. Whereas this one is not a trigonometric identity. Correct option for ninth question is B. The value of tan 25, tan 45, tan 65 is. Tan 25 and tan 65 are complementary angles. So tan 45 will be 1. Correct option is D1. From the given figure, theta is equal to. So, theta ki opposite number is chado, hypotenuse number is chado. So, we have to take sin because sin formula is opposite side by hypotenuse. Sin theta is equal to 10 by 20 which is nothing but 1 by 2. So, sin low in the degrees ki 1 by 2 to the so 30 degrees. Correct option is A 30 degrees. The median of first 8 odd prime numbers. Median and first we have to arrange in ascending order. Odd prime numbers end to So 3, 5, 7, 11, 13, 17, 19, 23. These are the odd prime numbers. The median will become the middle most value. In the middle most value there are two middle uh, most values which is median. So if there are two medians we have to take average of this one. So which is nothing but 12. So correct option for 13th question is B. 14th question if X and Y are any two co-prime then their GCD is always HCF or GCD for co-primes will be 1 and LCM, LCM will be X into Y. Regular LCM but we have to know. Sin square 90 plus cos square 90 value is 1. It is an identity. The exponential form of log B base A is equal to X is. So A power of X is equal to B is nothing but the exponential form of logarithm so correct option is b if a set of a and set b are disjoint set n of a and n of b in disjoint set disjoint set and a joint lane the in the intersection part of the gravity zero into the n of a intersection b value will become zero in disjoint set correct option is first question if x and y are two prime numbers then their lcm is lcm of any two prime numbers will be the product of their numbers so x into y is the correct answer. So just multiply the numbers x and y. So correct option for first question is D. The number of subsets of set 5, 10, 15, 20 is. So for, for every any subset number will be denoted with the formula 2 power of n. Where n is number of elements in the set. 
in this given set we have four elements 1 2 3 4 so 2 power of 4 is nothing but 16 so correct option for second question is c third question quotient of x in p of x is equal to 3x square minus 2x plus 1 is so x quotient is minus 2 so correct option is a the cost of 3 kg rice and 4 kg sugar is 304 and cost of 4 kg rice and 5 kg sugar is 540. The linear re re equation for the above situation is. So let us take rice as x and sugar as y. So 3x plus 4y is equal to 304 and 4x plus 5y is equal to 540. So correct option will be option A. Two triangles are not always similar. So circle is always similar, squares are also similar, triangle, only equilateral triangles are similar but other triangles are not similar. So correct option for 10th question is C. 11th question, triangle ABC and PQR, ABC and PQR are similar. Angle A is 32 means P is also 32 because they are similar. R is 65. If R is 65, obviously C will also be equal to 65. Then angle B is. So we all know the sum of three angles in a triangle is 180 degrees. So 32 plus 65 plus 80, 83 gives you 180 degrees. So correct option is A. Each exterior angle of an equilateral triangle is. Each angle of an equilateral triangle is 60 degrees. Exterior angle will be obviously 120 degrees. Because these two forms linear pair means some straight line. 60 plus 120 gives you 180. So exterior angle will be equal to 120. The reciprocal ratios among the following is sin theta and cosecant theta. Sin theta is 1 by cosecant theta. Cosecant theta is 1 by sin theta. They are reciprocal to each other. The length of the shadow of a tower on a plane ground is root 3 times the height of the tower. So we don't know the height of the tower. Let we will take height of the tower as x and shadow will be root 3x. We need to find the angle of the elevation of the sun rays with the ground. So we will take tan theta which is opposite side by adjacent side. So tan theta opposite we have taken as x adjacent we will take as root 3x. So xx get cancelled tan theta is equal to 1 by root 3 theta will become 30 degrees. Correct option is D. X is equal to B cosecant theta, Y is equal to B cot theta, then X square minus Y square. So we will square B square into cosecant square theta minus Y square. Y is given as B cot theta, y, y square will become B square cot square theta. In both cases, B square is common. We will take B square out. Cosecant square theta minus cot square theta we will write. So cosecant square theta minus cot square theta value we all know 1 it is identity b square into 1 is b square. So correct option for 17th question is C. Last question of this question paper median of the data 12. To find the median we need to arrange the numbers in ascending order students. So the least number here is 12, 13, then 18, 19, 20, 24 and 25. Now we need to pick the middle number out of this 7 observation middle number is 19 therefore median is 19 so correct option for 20th question is C.